Hello everyone, LEGO4366 here today. Today I'm reviewing um, Hasbro, the vintage collection Han Solo Stormtrooper, it cost $12.99. Um, I believe this is the um, re-release um, photorealistic application because um, if you look at this figure, he looks significantly more like Harrison Ford than um, the previous releases and you know so it's a really good figure I think it's the best version of the figure so I'm glad I bought it um, so yeah you can see um, from 2009 it was um, first came out 2008-2009 and um, here's the cool thing is that you can actually put his gun inside at least typically you can when it comes to these things. Maybe I made a false ass uh, assumption. Oh, it's supposed to go like outwards. Okay, I guess that's how it's supposed to go. Like that. So, that's kind of how it goes, which is pretty cool. Better than nothing. So, there you go. You have that. Um... Both hands, I think, can hold it. Let's see. Yep. You just press it in there. Kind of just stretch it. Both hands can hold the gun, so that's pretty nice. It's got a nice, nicely detailed painted gun, so that's kind of cool. Kind of unusual, so that's nice. Um, you can't take this off. That's um, a, a whole piece, so that's, so that's different than the other releases. Um... He's got a ball joint ankles, which is good. So yes, this is, I believe this is a photorealistic version. It's 3.75 inches. It's very nice to get. I believe we had a release with the Legacy Collection in 2008 or 2009. Um, and then it was re-released in a different wave around that time, too. And then I think the Black Series was released like in 2015, or maybe it was... Um, I can't remember if it was the uh, um, 6 inch or 3.75, maybe both, I can't actually remember, but yeah. So yeah, it's a good, it's a good set. Um, the thing is, is that if you already have this figure from when it released, it's still good to pick this up, if you can get it for um, less than the regular price like I did, um, because, you know, it'll do great as just a regular Stormtrooper, so it's great to have that to build your Stormtrooper army, and it's like, you know, very flexible than compared to like other Stormtrooper figs we got, so that's great. You know, he looks great. He's like the best Stormtrooper I have. Like in terms of articulation, and sort of just really awesome and pretty cool, so yeah. I mean, look. This was the only figure they had, and like, I didn't even have to go... And it was still the best, you know, face, because sometimes when you're looking at action figures, they don't, you have to kind of choose because they don't always have the, their face might be like smudged up or looking weird, so. But he's, he looks great, so that's good. And, um, you could all, and if you already have this figure, you could always, always switch this off and put Luke Skywalker's head on there, so. Whatever you want to do. And it's great because it's the vintage collection card back, so that's great for collectors. Um, so yeah, this is a, the New Hope, um. Han Solo Stormtrooper, which is pretty cool. So yeah, there's that. It's just pretty awesome, like, just like, his, his knuckles, the detailing on that, it's pretty cool. It's very awesome. I'm glad I got it, because I've always wanted this figure, and I saw it at a discount store and picked it up. You know, I love Dirt Cheap, where I got it from. They had, like, a whole case of this wave of figures, you know, like, with Ray and, um, with Ray and, um, Supreme Leader Snoke, and I decided to get this, and they also had, um, yeah, a photorealistic face application of, um, Lando, but I already got him before they released the photorealistic version, so I decided to get this, um, so yeah, so celebrate the legacy of Star Wars, the action adventure pack space saga from a galaxy far, far away with this collection of premium, highly detailed 3.75 inch action figure figures and vehicles. It shows you all the other ones you can get. It's pretty nice. 
see here's another regular stormtrooper they I would say that they're okay it's not exactly the same um as Han Solo like in terms of the body obviously the head would be completely different but and the gun is different so that's interesting and there's Lando and Chewbacca and these guys so yeah so that's pretty cool so yeah it's a great figure recommend you get it it may kind of just look like a simple re-release re but I actually think it's worth getting so yeah thanks guys